hello everyone welcome back and thank you for watching today i will be making some quick and easy diys using these dollar tree wood trays starting with my first project i will be using five of these wood trays now i do recommend you when you grab these make sure they're all nice and even i didn't pay attention and when i was already putting this together some of them were a little bit crooked, so my shelf turned out a little bit crooked. I am also using two of these Dollar Tree large signs. As you can see, these signs are black, so I am going to paint the back of these signs using some black paint. Now, I didn't paint the entire tray black. I only painted like the sides and like the border. As you can see, some of the sides I didn't paint because these are going to be glued into the other side, so you can't really see these. And I also did the bottom of these. Now, I'm going to use hot glue to glue these to the long sides. You can use wood glue if you like. I'm not adding anything heavy, so I decided to just use hot glue. One thing I really didn't do is like measure these to make sure they were nice and straight. So I first thought it was that, but I and then I ended up realizing it was actually the tray. So they're a little bit crooked. But other than that, the last thing I did was just add the top part to this. And that is it for this beautiful shelf. Now you can use this for several different things. You can add decor. Now this was actually made for my mom. She will be adding her medicine to this.
for my next project i will be using two of the wood trays and two of these dollar tree wood pieces now i'm going to do the same thing i will be doing a shelf but this time the trays are going to be a slanted to the side I do recommend you using wood glue instead of hot glue or a mix of wood glue and hot glue. <laughs> I only use wood glue because I will not be adding anything heavy to this. The next thing I will be doing is painting this using the Waverly Antique Wax. And that is it. Look how beautiful this turned out. Now you can use this to add some decor. I will be using mine to add some makeup. And that is it for today. I really hope you guys have enjoyed today's video. Let me know down in the comment section which one was your favorite because I would love to know. So thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already. And until next time, bye.